this video is to show the timing. We have the pin inserted onto the crank. I decided to do this next instead of pulling the rocker assembly. And I'll follow by pulling the cam gears. That's about 1 a.m. December 1st, I do believe. Everything is still intact. Haven't touched nothing. As you can see, it's on the insert pin mark. And now, we'll show how far off it is. Which is the least of my problems. <clears throat> This video is for legal purposes, per my legal counsel's request, and for that purpose only. So here's where the timing wedge goes, right here in the slot. And there's supposed to be a flat spot right there on this setting. I don't know what good it would do, but I have the wedge four degree. Obviously it's round, so it's not gonna go in there. This is the injection cam. Again, no trickery. Everything's still set. Still can't get over them injection cam bearings <laughs> between cylinder number four as you can see and number five just can't get over that this whole thing's had me definitely dealing with some mental anguish I'm gonna by myself because it's so early in the morning <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and pull this valve cam gear. It looks like there's some scoring on my rockers. I'm assuming from the copper metal shavings that's running through my motor. Again, I apologize about the poor quality of this video. I'm not an expert video taker. This one shouldn't be too bad to get off if they set it properly. Should only be 109 pounds according to coming spec with Loctite number 609 on it or an accumulative Loctite. I don't know if I can hold this at the same time, but we'll give her a shot. Excuse me. I think at this point this motor's foobarred. <laughs> Won't see any evidence. Well, it's actually really clean of any sort of Loctite or compound at all on this. 
valve cam gear. Well, let's take it off. I'll have to set this down for just a sec while I get the setup going here. Bear with me here, still getting these bolts in here. This is going to be tricky to do myself, but I'll give her a shot. Well, that came off awful easy. <clears throat> this is why you don't remanufacture cams. I don't think it should have came off that easy, but what do I know, right? Wow, looks awful clean. I don't see any evidence of any Loctite whatsoever, <laughs> or retaining compound at all do you all I see is oil bear with me here I'm gonna go ahead and clean this up real quick Let me take this off here and Let's give her a little wipey. According to Cummins manual, sorry, you're seeing my messy shop. According to this Cummins manual, on my specific engine, you're supposed to use Loctite 609. And that is pretty darn clean to me. Not sure what that mark is. Pretty just where it was sitting. Not sure if that's even right. Huh. No evidence whatsoever of any retaining compound. I don't even know if it was sitting right. This would be the valve cam gear. I'm just going to give her a little wipe. Wipe this oil up here. This contaminated oil now. Wow. Looks awful clean to me. I don't see any compound on it. At all. 
None. Nothing. Well, I'll move to the injector cam. Thanks. 